Welcome to our lecture online. Here are some additional terms that we should get accustomed to, especially when we're dealing with angles, especially the concept of the measure of an angle. Now here we have drawn three rays, the ray BC, the ray BA, and the ray BD. So you can see that all three rays have the common endpoint B. The question that may be asked is, how many angles are there? And it turns out there's three angles. We have an angle we can call from A to B to C like this, so we can write it like this. So we have angle ABC. We have angle DBA. And we have a third angle, DBC. Of course, we could reverse the order of these letters. We could have written the angle of CBA, the angle of ABD, and the angle CBD would be the same three angles. So there's only three of them, but nevertheless, we have an angle between those two rays, an angle between those two rays, and an angle between those two rays. So there's a total of three rays. So let's now talk about the measure of an angle, and that's how we say it in geometry. It means how many degrees are there between those two rays in, that we're considering. So here we write M with the angle symbol ABC. So this is the notation for the angle ABC that would be from A to B to C. That's this angle right here. And so we can say we could put a little curved line in there that kind of indicates there's an angle and that represents the measure of that angle. And the measure of an angle is always expressed in degrees and if we want to kind of have a, a relationship there we can say that there's 360 degrees in the full measure of a circle so when we start at one end here and we go all the way around the circle that's equivalent to 360 degrees so a half a circle is 180 degrees a quarter circle is 90 degrees and half of that would be an angle of 45 degrees so here for example if we want to measure that angle right here, well, it looks like it's, well, estimated. I didn't actually use a protractor, which is commonly what we would use. But here, let's say that's about 24 degrees. So we can say that the measure of the angle ABC is equal to 24 degrees. And that's exactly how we say it. The measure of the angle ABC is equal to 24 degrees. And so some additional basic terms related to angles in geometry.